So good morning, good afternoon, and good evening. In this video, I'm going to teach you how to create output rich tech metafield using custom liquid block in Shopify. So the first thing I want you to do is of course add this custom liquid section. It should be clicking this add block button right there and just typing in custom liquid. Wait for it to load up and give you the result. You should just click on this one and it will be added directly on your choices over here. So we have no more problem on this custom liquid, right? So the question is, what are we going to put inside here? Now that's where this other landing page comes in. It's going to be where your order or rather your product is in. For example, this one right here. I want you to go down and look for meta fields. If you don't have this specific section yet, don't worry, I'm going to show you how to add this up because this is where we're going to edit our description. And the best thing about this one, you can now use bullet eyes. For example, APA product, more organized, more slick looking, more detailed, more accurate for me, rather than this option right here where it's just a sentence. So for example, I'm going to type in blue. This is what I love about bullet, red, something like that. I'm going to delete that, okay? So how to add this meta field section? Simply click on settings over here and then scroll a little, a little bit down and look for custom data. And then click on products. So since I already have a feature section earlier, I'm going to add this up, okay? Add definition over there. Now simply click on features. Or rather, since I have a feature, I'm going to name this just sample one. Okay? Now this is going to be my namespace and key. Basically, it's just the name of this specific meta field. You can shade just whatever you want, but I'm going to stick with this one first. Now, pay attention on this next step because this is actually important. Click select type over here. Look for rich field or rich text. Once you have rich text right there, click on save and you're good to go. Now, since I'm going to use features right there, I'm going to go back. I'm just going to go back, click X here, and it will reload my page. Since I added two Metafield features now, I should having I should have two Metafield features. And as you can see, the one we added earlier is here, and the one I added before is here also. So I'm good to go now for Metafield. Now next thing, go back to the liquid earlier, right? Now I'm gonna get this one and click on custom liquid. Now basically, how can we input at everything we put in this Metafield on this specific liquid code? First things first, of course, let's input something or inside features first. Let's just use features meta field, okay? Let's just say, let me just get this bullet eyes and let's say red, blue. Again, you don't have to copy me here. This is going to be your own description, what your product is going to look like. So red, blue, violet. Let's just stick with that one, just for discussion purposes. Now, with this one, I'm just going to click on save. Make sure it's saved. And then I'm going to go back to this template. On this liquid code, we're going to get a code, okay? So just copy whatever I type here. You can post the video. So product. Over your product. Meta fields. And then this is going to be the custom um, name earlier. The one that I said you can name it whatever you want. Just make sure you type in the perfect or correct one here. So this is going to be a constant code. You don't have to change anything. Unless your meta field is not featured name, for example, you'd name it, for example, let's just say it's Iron Man or Batman over here. So it's going to be custom that Batman. Okay. So I'm just going to close this code that one up. So we're good to go. So make sure that it's going to be looking like this. So the only changes you're going to make here is this one, this name right here. For example, I used the one that we created earlier, the sample one. I should put sample one here. But since I'm going to proceed with features over here, I'm just going to stick with features. Okay. I'm just go back and type in features. So product metafields dot features and this slash right here, metafield underscore tag. And we're good to go. Click on save. So changes are saved. Those things that I added earlier here in the description should be displayed on my landing page right now on my website. So that being said, that's how you add or create an output rich check meta field using custom liquid block in Shopify. Thank you so much for watching. Please hit the like button and subscribe. I'll catch you guys in the next one, okay? Goodbye for now.